The communities of Stamford and Abilene came together this afternoon to host a garage sale to help one of their own after they completely lost their home. Yaro Roberto was there bringing us tonight's story. We were getting out eating fish. She had cooked some fish. We got up to take some plates back in the house. After we discovered it was on fire. And their house of 40 years went from looking like this to this. We lost everything. And we didn't have any insurance on it. Yeah, I think it happened on a Sunday. Uh, and we didn't hear about it until the next morning when, uh, when Don actually came to work. But little did they know, they already had a community behind them, ready to help wherever they could. We, we knew immediately that we needed to help Don out. As soon as people heard about what was going on with Don, they, uh, you know, the GoFundMe page, uh, con contributions, uh, people came out of nowhere. To organize this garage sale and raise money for the maze so they can have a home again. We, we got a trailer home. Uh, all I got to do is get it paid for. You may wonder, how does a garage sale come together when they have lost everything? And that's because everything you see here has been donated by the people in the community who just wanted to help. But, uh, it's been overwhelming, the support. We've had items that have come from everywhere. Again, a lot of people we don't, have never met uh, and who don't know Don have brought items to help raise money. Abilene community has stepped up. Oh. This is a wonderful event. It is wonderful. It is. That shows how much people care for you. You know, people really care. God is working, I tell you. We appreciate everything that people have done. We thank them from the bottom of our heart. In Abilene, with coverage you can count on, Yara Roberto, KTAB News. Thanks, Yada. If you would like to contribute and help out the maze, you can find the link to their GoFundMe page on the KTEB website. That's BigCountryHomePage.com.